Hello, good afternoon all students. We have learned the lesson number 1.4 of English story time Yash and Moti. Now today we are going to revise this lesson again. I am going to read this lesson again. If you want, I will explain this lesson again and we will discuss about this question answers of this lessons. Okay. So, shall we start? Okay. So, first of all, I will read the sentences and after that, you should repeat the sentences after me. Okay. So, let's start. Page number 7. Lesson number 1.4. Story time. Yash and Moti. Listen and repeat. Yash was happy. Students, you should re uh, repeat after me. Yash was happy. His mother bought him new shoes. He woke up early in the morning. He went out to look at his own new shoes. He cried. There is only one shoe here. Where is my other shoe? He looked everywhere. It means Yash was very happy because his mother bought him new shoes and early in the morning he woke up and he went out of the house and he was shocked to see only one shoe were there and one shoe was missing and he cried that uh, there is only one shoe so students यश बहुत हैप्पी था क्योंकि उसकी मम्मी ने उसको नए जूते दिलाए थे वो जल्दी सुबह उठा उठ के बाहर घर से गया और देखा तो वहाँ पे सिर्फ एक ही शूज था इट मीन्स एक ही जूता था तो वो देख के बहुत रोया और उसने हर जगह देखा कि कहीं पे वो शू मिल रहा है या नहीं नेक्स्ट पैराग्राफ रिपीट आफ्टर मी ओके ही कुडेंट फाइंड इट he sat outside on a step and sobbed. Just then, Moti came and started wagging his tail. He barked, bow, wow. Yash looked at Moti. Moti, have you seen my shoe? Jab uh, Yash ne sari taraf dhunda, kahi pe shoes mil raha ya nahi? Usko kahi pe bhi wo shoes nahi mila. Wo bahar ki taraf pe uh, steps pe uh, sad sa betha. Tabhi Moti aaya. Usne apne tail uh, ye pooch hilate huye baag kiya. तो यश ने उसको पूछा कि आप मोती तुमने मेरा शूज कहीं पे देखा है नेक्स्ट पैराग्राफ वाओ वाओ रिपीट स्टूडेंट्स आफ्टर मी ओके मोती पार्क एंड रैन टू अ ट्री इन द फ्रंट यार्ड यश फॉलोड मोती देयर वाज अ होल अंडर द ट्री Yash saw his shoe in the hole. A big fat rat had carried it there. Yash picked it up. Abhi next paragraph mein bataya hai. मोती बार्क करने लगा एंड वो एक ट्री की तरफ दौड़ता हुआ दौड़ता हुआ गया उस ट्री के आगे वाली यार्ड में इसमें इट मींस आगे वाली जगह पे या जगह तक वो मोती गया और यश उसके पीछे पीछे गया उस ट्री के सामने एक होल था 
और यश ने उस होल में देखा तो वहाँ पे उसका वो शू था अ बिग फैट रैट हर कैरिड इट डर इट मीन्स एक बड़ा सा चूहा उसने वो शू वहाँ पे लेके गया था और यश ने वो अपना जूता उठाया और अपने पास लिया नाउ स्टूडेंट्स टर्न द पेज पेज नंबर एट Thank God, he said. The rat has not nibbled my shoe. It is in good condition. Oh, oh, Moti, I agreed. Thank you, Moti, said Yash. Abhi Yash ne bula ki acha hua rat ne mere shoes ko koi bhi nuksan nahi pochaya. Aur wo juta abhi bhi achhi condition mein hai. To jo Moti tha, usne bark karte hue. यश को एग्री है ऐसे दिखाया फिर मो यश ने मोती को थैंक यू कहा नाउ स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू अंडरस्टूड द लेसन अगेन वी विल सी द क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स देन वी विल रीड द लेसन वंस अगेन ओके सो क्वेश्चन नंबर ए इज फाइंड द वर्ड्स इन स्टोरी विच मीन बिटन कट ऑफ विथ टीथ and the meaning of bitten cut off with teeth it means is the meaning of this word is nibbled second cried noisily noisily and the meaning of cried noisily in the lesson is sobbed now see the question number b answer in a word or phrase who bought new shoes for yash so students tell me who bought new shoes for yash and the answer is mother how did yash feel then when mother bought the shoes for yash then how did yash feel yash feels happy so the answer is happy third question is why was yash sobbing he couldn't find shoes answer is he couldn't find shoes that's why the yash sobbing who had carried yash shoe to the hole a big fat rat is the answer now see the question number c put the following sentences in the correct order now students you have five sentences over here and um you have five square uh, rectangles over there you have to write the sequence numbers in the rectangle boxes okay so first of all we will see the sentences there is only one shoe here yash saw his shoe in the hole yash followed moti his mother gave him new shoes Thank you, Muti. Said yes. Now, students, here are uh, five sentences that shows the incidents of uh, yes and Muti. So we have to rearrange the sentences in the sequence. So first sentence is his mother gave him new shoes. Sentence number four. You have to write one. Um. Beside the box of his mother gave him new shoes. Sentence number four is the first sentence. Second sentence is there is only one shoe here. It means first sentence is second incident. There is only one shoe here. Next third sentence Yash followed Moti. This is the third uh, incident. Next, Yash saw saw his shoe in the hole. Is the fourth incident. And thank you, Moti said Yash. This is the fifth incident. So fourth sentence is first incident. First sentence is second incident. Third sentence is third incident. Second sentence is fourth incident. And fifth sentence is fifth incident. So have you written the numbers? in the blocks very good now look and say students you have to repeat this uh, words after me s h o e s shoes 
S H O E S shoes. S H O E S shoes. Next word is M O R N I N G morning. M O R N I N G morning. M O R N I N G morning. S O double B E D soft. S O double B E D soft. S O double B E D soft. W A double G I N G wagging. W A double G I N G wagging. W A double G I N G wagging. B A R K E D barked. B A R K E D barked. B A R K E D barked. Y A R D yard. Y A R D yard. Y A R D yard. N I double B L E D nibbled. N I double B L E D nibbled. N I double B L E D nibbled. C O N D I T I O N condition. C O N D I T I O N condition. C O N D I T I O N condition. Now students, you have to learn this question and answers at your home and write these all question and answers one time again in the H W. Part. So we will meet tomorrow. Till then, bye bye and take care.